let us understand how to draw pressure volume and temperature entropy diagram for the diesel cycle process 0 to 1 is for the suction process where air is getting inside the piston cylinder arrangement so so we will show this process on the pressure volume diagram so here is the point 0 and this is the point 1 now next process is isentropic compression process where air is getting compressed inside the piston cylinder arrangement and this time entropy remains constant so here isentropic word is used so we will show here s is equal to constant now what is the effect on pressure and temperature because of the compression so when the compression process is taking place volume decreases and as the volume decreases pressure increases and because of increase in pressure temperature also increases now with the help of these parameters we will draw the pressure volume diagram so pressure increases and volume decreases so point 1 is here that means this is v1 so we have to show decrease in volume but increase in pressure so i will select the point 2 now we will draw temperature entropy diagram increase in temperature but entropy remain constant so here s remains constant and increase in temperature so i will show here the point 1 and this is the point 2 so increase in temperature and here we will show s1 is equal to s2 now we will move to the process 2 to 3 constant pressure heat addition now for this case heat addition is taking place but pressure remain constant so p is equal to constant and because of heat addition we know that temperature increases entropy also increases so we will show here increase in temperature increase in entropy also now we have one relation in between pressure volume and temperature so as temperature increases pressure also increases and volume decreases but this time pressure is constant so because of the constant pressure uh, in decrease in volume we will convert into increase in volume so this is important this is important point so as temperature increases pressure increases volume decreases but p remains constant so we will show increase in volume so we will show this process on pv diagram so p remain constant that means draw the horizontal line and v increases so we have to show this v2 is that means v3 is greater than v2 so point 3 here now we will move to the temperature entropy so increase in temperature and increase in entropy so how to show this so we have to show this with increase in temperature and increase in entropy so remember whenever the heat addition process is taking place entropy always increases and for the heat rejection entropy always decreases now isentropic expansion process so here is expansion taking place s remains constant now when the expansion is taking place that time pressure decreases so as the pressure decreases temperature also decreases and volume increases so this is the relation in between p v t so pressure decreases and volume increases so we have to show here so decrease in pressure but increase in volume so i will show here this process increase in volume but decrease in pressure and what about the temperature the entropy temperature decreases s remains constant so i will show here s constant and temperature decreases so this is 4 s3 is equal to s4 then process 4 to 1 constant volume heat rejection so we know that whenever the heat rejection process taking place s 
decreases. So T decreases. And here the volume remains constant. Now if we observe this parameter, we have to show volume remain constant. This is the process 4 to 1. So if we observe with constant volume, we have to draw straight vertical line. And we can say that from the diagram, pressure decreases. Now if we observe, we know that when temperature decreases, then volume increases and pressure decreases. But here, volume remain constant. So I will connect these points. And for this uh, diagram, TS diagram, temperature decreases, entropy decreases. So decrease in temperature. So T4 is here. So we have to show in this way. Now process 1 to 0. So as the 0 to 1 is for the suction process, then process 1 to 0 is for the exhaust. So these two processes are opposite to each other and for the calculation, we have to consider only from 1, 2, 3, 4 to 1. So this cycle we have to consider.